C'est pas bien de se suicider parce que pour les morts. Shall cast my do not think from my slavery to morphine that I am a weakling or a degenerate. Non, pas du tout, it was in one of the most open and least frequented parts of the broad Pacific that the packet of which I was supercargo fell a victim to the German Sea Raider. The weather kept fair, and for uncounted days I drifted aimlessly beneath the scorching sun, waiting either for some passing ship or to be cast on the shores of some habitable land. But neither ship nor land appeared, and I began to despair in my solitude upon the heaving vastness of unbroken blue. Mais, euh... change happened while for my slumber though troubled and dream infested was continuous oh, va, hein? it was to discover myself half sucked into a slimy expanse of hellish black mire which extended about me in monotonous undulations as far as i could see and in which my boat lay grounded some distance away Donc, tu one might well imagine that I realized that only one theory could explain my position. Through some unprecedented volcanic upheaval, a portion of the ocean floor must have been thrown to the surface, exposing regions for which innumerable millions of years had lain hidden under unfathomable watery depths. All day I forged steadily westward. Guided by a faraway hummock which rose higher than any other element in the dinosaur. desert. By the fourth evening, I attained the base of the mound, which turned out to be much higher than it had appeared from a distance. An intervening valley setting it out in sharper relief from the general surface. Too weary to ascend, I slept in the shadow of the hill. I know not why my dreams were so wild that night. But ere the waning and fantastically gibbous moon had risen far above the eastern plain, I was awake in a cold perspiration, determined to sleep no more. Such visions as I had experienced were too much for me to endure again, and in the glow of the moon I saw how unwise I had been to travel by day. Without the glare of the parching sun, my journey would have cost me less energy. Indeed, I now felt quite able to perform the ascent which had deterred me at sunset. Struck at this unexpected glimpse into a past beyond the conception of the most daring anthropologist, I stood musing whilst the moon cast queer reflections on the silent channel before me. Then, suddenly, I saw it. With only a slight churning to mark its rise to the surface, the thing slid into view above the dark waters. Last, polyphemus like and loathsome, it darted like a stupendous monster of nightmares to the monolith, about which it flung its gigantic scaly arms, the while it bowed its hideous head. I think I went mad then. Of my frantic ascent of the slope and cliff, and of my delirium. I sang a great deal, and laughed oddly when I was unable to sing. Hospital. Brought thither by the captain of the American ship in my delirium, I had said much, but found that my words had been given scant attention. Of any land upheaval in the Pacific, my rescuers knew nothing. Nor did I deem it necessary to insist upon a thing which I knew they could not believe. J'aime pas qu'on des portes se comme ça d'un coup. Once. 
brightest at night, especially when the moon is gibbous and waning, that I see the thing. I tried morphine, but the drug has given only transient surcease and has drawn me. So now. Often, I ask myself if it could not all have been a pure phantasm. A mere freak of fever as I lay sun-stricken and raving in the open boat after my escape from the German man of war. The I cannot think of the deep sea without shuddering at the nameless things that may at this very moment worshipping their ancient stone idols and carving their own detestable likenesses on submarine obelisks of water-soaked granite. I dream of a day when they may rise above the billows to drag down into their reeking talons. The <laughs> puny, the land shall sink, and the dark ocean shall ascend amidst universal pandemonium. It shall not find me. God, that hand. The window, the window. Ouais. <rire> Il y en a d'autres. Bon.